Now to Brussels, where prosecutors have charged four more suspects in relation to last month's bombings. The latest arrests follow a series of raids by Belgian police. Tashana Reed is sifting through the details for us. So what's happening right now in Brussels? Well, Andrew, we're learning more details uh, about these suspects that have been charged by Belgian police. Uh, officials have charged four people of being part of a terrorist organization and participating in terrorist murders. Now, their names are Mohamed Abrini, Osama K, which we have uh, now know is Osama Karen, Krayim, uh, Hervé BM, and Bilal El Mahouki. Uh, now, these men were detained after a series of raids that were carried out in the Brussels uh, neighborhood of Etterbeek, and a total of six suspects were arrested when the raids began uh, early uh, Friday morning. Uh, one suspect was even picked up today, Saturday, but only four of those suspects remained in police custody. Two were released after interrogation uh, and were told that uh, they have been able to leave police custody. But one of the men that has been charged is this man. His name is Mohamed Abrini. He is the last identified suspect that was at large from the Paris attacks. He was also seen in video with Salah Abdesalam, uh, Again, another uh, a suspect that had been at large for months since the Paris attacks. And investigators are also trying to confirm whether or not um, Abrini is the man in the hat. And that was uh, the third suspect that was seen in security footage uh, walking with two suicide bombers inside of, uh, of the Brussels airport. Uh, of course, we know those uh, attackers uh, blew themselves up. That attack left 32 people dead. Uh, but you know, Swedish media uh, had had um, also identified the second suspect as this man, Osama Kram from Sweden, uh, and he was also known to have been fighting in Syria and has been linked to the attack in Brussels as well. Andrew? And what do we know about the suspects? Well, of course, these two suspects, we have been linked to the two major attacks, uh, of course, in Paris that killed 130 people and the attack in Brussels just in March. Uh, but we are learning about the two other men that have been held. They've been identified as two Rwandan nationals, uh, Hervé BM and 27-year-old Bilal El Mahouki. Now, we do know some details about Bilal. He was arrested last year uh, by police. Uh, he had been uh, charged with recruiting people to fight alongside jihadist organizations. He himself had fought in Syria and uh, had been under electronic supervision. So he was known to Belgian authorities and we're still waiting on clarification for his charges. Andrew? Thanks, Thanks to Shana. You're welcome.